uh, you have already mentioned some of the possible benefits. Um, and you mentioned the companies that uh, stand behind this project, uh, language service providers or LSPs. Let's perhaps look at this from their perspective. What do they stand to gain uh, from this initiative? How can it be beneficial to companies in the industry? Yes, um, I believe this is a win-win. That's why I like what we are developing. Um, if you look at the cycle of uh, subtitlers first steps, okay? So let's say that I am very enthusiastic about subtitling and I decide I want to become a subtitler. I try to find the best master out there. I invest my money and I am told the basic skills of, well, uh, you know, that I need to become a subtitler. Then I graduate and then what happens? To find a job, I need to take hundreds of tasks to be onboarded by each and every company out there, right? There are many, big, small. And the problem is that, do we know if these tests are really good enough to find the best professionals? Um, will professionals get, well, translators, will they get a feedback afterwards? It's very, very unlikely. So I'm trying to start my career and I already find myself lost in the process. Meanwhile, each company is investing money and energy in testing, assessing, onboarding and training these newcomers. And they are still unsure about who is good and who is bad, right? So this system doesn't work, it is not sustainable anymore for, you know, both parties, I guess. So if we go back to myself as a student, I think that being certified is beneficial for maybe someone who has just started their career in the industry or wants to start it. Some reasons to be certified. So I can actually have a validation of my skills, right? Um, I can demonstrate to a direct client or an employer that I have the necessary expertise to provide high quality subtitling services. Uh, there's also a competitive advantage. So with a certification, I can set myself apart from others who are not certified without this kind of credential. So I can stand out in, you know, and in a job market that is crowded and I can increase my chances to work. Um, credibility. Um, if the certification comes from, uh, you know, a reputable organization, I can enhance my credibility in the eyes of employers out there. Um, it also shows that I went through a process of, you know, rigorous selection, and that I have achieved the highest level possible in my field. There's also the continuing education um, thing. It means that, you know, many certifications out there uh, require ongoing training and education to maintain that credential. And we haven't really gone into that particular thing with the AVT Pro, but we are certainly looking into, you know, options there. I don't think it doesn't have to be something coming from the inside, but I don't know why. The AVT Masterclass, for example, could be a provider of ongoing training. This is an example, you know, many other organizations and companies out there could deal with this part. Um, you know, there are so many ideas around and everything is in development and in progress right now.